everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sahar and today is going to be an interesting video. I will be comparing soap that is marketed for brows and just regular soap. So if you're interested in this video and if you're interested in my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell to be informed when I upload. Being a chemist, I know that the soaps are just kind of the same ingredients. So I'm like, what's the difference between a soap marketed as a, like a brow soap? and just regular soap. So let's get into the video. I chose a brand that was being sold a lot on Shopee and I'll be linking that down below. This is the Wax Up Brow by Zoena Naturals. And this is marketed as a brow soap. It is not tinted, it is just a pure clear brow soap. This comes with two spoolies. The spoolie I, I have is broken because it's not a good spoolie at all, but it has two of these. It comes with two free spoolies. And they're not that good. The ingredients on here are glycerine, castor oil, aloe vera extract, and I'm pretty sure that's just uh, that's not it. That's not everything. I'm sure it comes with the regular ingredients you need to make soap. It says it's 100% vegan, handmade, so you get 20 grams of soap. I actually like the packaging. It's very nice. It's very easy. It snaps shut. I bought this on Shopee for 130 pesos or 2.67 dollars, give or take. Shipping fee was around 45 pesos or 0.93 dollars. So I spent almost 175 pesos or 3.60 dollars for this little brow soap over here. Per gram with shipping fee, that comes to 8.75 pesos per gram or 0.18 dollars per gram. This is the regular soap. This is the Zen Neutrals Pure Soap made for newborns and sensitive skin. They actually have a bunch of different kinds, but I wanted to get the one that closely resembles this one. And this is clear. They have like colored ones, but I don't want to have like orange, tinted orange browns. I prefer the clear one. And it says it's for newborns and sensitive skin. So, I mean, why not? If I could just take this out of the packaging, it looks almost identical. It also smells almost identical. They don't really have a distinct scent. Oh, my phone just fell down. So I did buy this in the mall, but I don't know if you can buy it online. Pretty sure you can. You can buy everything online nowadays. So this has the basics of soap. It has purified water, sodium palmitate, sucrose, glycerin. And it comes in 100 grams. And I paid 138 pesos or 2.84 dollars per gram. That's about 1.38 pesos per gram or 0 0.0284 dollars per gram. Which is the winner? You know this is. I mean, you get so much. They're basically the same price. If you buy this without shipping fee, it will cost you 130 pesos or 2.67 dollars. This, if it doesn't have shipping fee, I went to the mall to buy it and I walked to the mall because I live near the mall. This is 138. So eight dollars more than this, but you get 20 grams. Here you get 100. So price alone, you know this is the winner. So you can see how I put it on my brows. I'm actually having them on today. This is the brow soap side and this is the soap side. And honestly, right off the bat, I actually prefer this because how fluffy my hair is as opposed to this. This, maybe it's application. It was It's a little bit flat. And af after the day progresses, it kind of goes back to its original shape. And I have tried these with both brows. Number one, when doing strenuous activity, they both did not fare well. If you're planning to sweat, if you're planning to go to the beach or somewhere with water, it will not stay. It's soap. It's not waterproof. And when you try to wipe your face, you're gonna wonder what's soapy and slimy. So that's a no for both. The view was overnight. So I applied them both the night before and slept. When I woke up, I still woke up to fairly up their lash, uh, not, not lashes, um, brows, but I noticed that they both did not stay up as well. Although the soap did hold up better, in my opinion. What you can do is you can just brush them up again and then they will just go back to the way you brush them. Third test is like the lazy day, chill day test where I just wasn't really doing anything. They did stay the same way, like really nice and the way I combed it. But again, I prefer how this looked on my brows. It's just, it felt like it was easier to shape. It was, it felt fluffier and it felt like it stayed 
in place more. And I'm not only saying this because this is cheaper or anything, but I'm just, it's reality. That's how I, I tested it for maybe about a week or two. And I just prefer the performance of this. And it's cheaper, you get more product. The only con is it doesn't have free spoolies, but I'm pretty sure you have a spoolie, a better quality spoolie. You can find one. And this doesn't have the packaging that you get with this. You actually pay for packaging as well because this is just, it's so much more convenient to use this. But if I can somehow like cut this up and then just like stick it in here, maybe that would be ideal. I'm not saying this is a bad product. I'm just saying that with the money you spend versus this, I'm pretty sure you this is just, it's just better overall. Would I pick brow soap over a traditional brow gel? I don't think so. I think I'd stick with a traditional brow gel just because number one you can get waterproof brow gels and number two you can get a lot of different colored brow gels with the spoolie already intact you don't need to wet it you don't need to rub it on a spoolie on the soap and then place it on your brows and you can basically do anything like go to the gym go swimming if you have a good brow gel on it won't really mess up with your brows unlike with the soaps um the soaps they'll just they're so look who decided to join us oh you're complaining because i love you i love you so much oh, meow, meow. this is biscuit by the way hey. there you have it everybody i hope you enjoyed the video and found it helpful in any way don't forget to hit that subscribe button like this video if you did comment down below which is your favorite brow soap if you tried brow soap if you tried brow gel which you prefer and uh, don't forget to hit that notification bell to be informed when I upload. I hope to see you in my next one. Bye!